Oh my God, what a beautiful, beautiful place. After a lovely breakfast, I had a beautiful omelette. I didn't bother with the sausage or the rashes. An omelette, very healthy for you. And after the omelette, we have a little dram. Small one. For the chest. Cheers. <coughs> For the chest. <sighs> the shy man's after arriving. This is some morning, isn't it? A fine morning. I think you're after getting a few more since I seen you last. Not too, Vincent. <laughs> Are you polishing up the... Polishing it. You're polishing them. It's shining underneath the trophy. Wow. Especially with the sunlight. You're a real professional. What advice have you got for me, Shyman? I want to keep casting, Vince. Conditions aren't great, but keep keep uh, hammering it. Obviously, we won't come up to you. That's good. Now you're covering the water, lovely there. There's a nice breeze there, and it's very bright. had no luck and eventually we decided it was time to take a break and to go in and have a bit of grub. I see we're not the only fishermen whose bellies are calling them in for a bite. <laughs> a local gilly Dominic and his client are joining us for the grub. Are you on a diet, lads? <laughs> the shy man cooking sausages. I'll be doing that after a few pints. You lose a finger. <laughs> That's what you call cooperation. Cooperation. It's oh, it's like now. Nah, don't worry about that. It's an international effort. <laughs> What's that you've got, Vincent? Ah? What's that you've got? Top of whiskey and a Guinness. Oh. A Guinness one for everyone. Oh, for the chest, is it? You drink a Guinness? You drink a Guinness? No, I don't like it. Keep it for later, maybe. No, I'll have a bit drunk. A drunk, sir. Do you have a Guinness, shy man? No, I don't drink Guinness. Treat for me, sir. So. <laughs> <laughs> that was great. Oh. What's the name of that whiskey, Vince? That's Powers. Powers, all of them. That helps you catch a salmon. Mm. You, drop, you want to drop your tea? Are you sure? Give a drop in your tea. Not in my tea, no. Will you, have you a glass or do you want to drink out of the bottle? After my tea, obviously. Alright, so I'll put it there. Let's... 
It's coming to the bride. Oh, it's lovely, thanks. Leave a bit of room for the whiskey. <laughs> Cheers, my man. I will. Thanks very much, Dominic. You're, you're a decent man. Cheers. That's loads, thanks. Yeah, please. Thanks very much. There it is, Nick. How much you want? Three, please. Thanks very much. I only ever got two off the shy man. He wouldn't give me three. Thanks very much. Cheers. Oh, that's brilliant. Isn't life great? I'll leave it in. Thanks very much, Dominic. We devoured all the sausages and we had a great chat around the frying pan. But all good things eventually come to an end. Are you heading back out, lads? Try again. Thanks for the sausages. See ya. They were the shy mans. I see you later, man. I hope you catch a big one. I see ya. Belly's full. We're all back out on the lake trying to catch a fish. The shy man wastes no time getting his lures out into the water while I enjoy a beautiful pint of Guinness. Did you ever count how many have you? No, never count. <laughs> There's years and years. That's how you mount, Toby. You pull it like that. You sit the bait underneath like that, like. So the fish takes it, the hook is in his mouth, and the little bait comes up the line. So he has nothing to leave it. Brilliant. You know? yeah. Who taught you that? Oh, my father. Did he? Yeah. That's one of your secrets out now. Well, no, it's just a lot of people like local and use it. Having the time of our lives out on the lake. Against all the odds, eventually I hook a fish. It's not a big salmon, but a fish is a fish. I didn't want the day to end with my friend, the 
shy man. But all good things come to an end. Well, shy man, I have to say before you go. I had a great time that's good, that's good. and thanks very much for your hospitality and for all the fish we caught. <laughs> <laughs> we'll get in the next time. Yeah, at least we got a suntan in We got a bit of a suntan. <laughs> thanks, Shaiman, and I'll be back. Yeah, home now, thanks. Please. God bless. Thank you. Bye -bye. See ya. I had a great time down in Waterville with the Shaiman and I caught plenty of trout, but I didn't catch the salmon. Maybe next time I'll get a big beautiful salmon. Can't wait to get back down there again. Fantastic fisherman, he's loads of great stories. So we caught nothing, <laughs> one little shot. And we went into the bank for a bit of grub and we met Dominic McGilligoddy, if I'm pronouncing his name correctly. He's a gilly on Loch Cram. We had his clank with him. And we had a laugh, and it was a miracle. It was a miracle that no one lost a finger. The way they were cutting the sausages, and the knife was a very sharp knife, very sharp knife. It was a miracle no one lost a finger. <laughs> Going up to the house and you're missing a finger. How did you lose your finger? It's cooking sausages. But anyway, we had a great time. And until my next video, get out and catch a fish. And what I'll be doing in my next video, I have no idea. But uh, until then, <laughs> until then, good luck. Previously in my last video, the soul came off my shoe and Michael the Bootman glued it back together again for me and it was a great success. <sighs> you won't believe what's after happening. I'm after driving all the way home from the lake and I, I've just arrived home. I just got out of the car and when my foot touched the ground, you won't believe what's after happening. Look at my foot. Look at that. The back is glued on. <laughs> Michael did a great job. That's solid. <laughs> That's after coming off. <sighs> <laughs>